Hello everyone! So Hayden is officially a player. He completed the Cyril Romantic Aspiration. I'm so proud of him. So all he needs to do now, before he ages up into a young adult, is to max out the Charisma skill. I want him to do that before he ages up. I think he's got five more days left. And Hayden also needs to get a job. <laughs> He's starting to run out of money. He's probably got enough to last him for the next five days. But I do think he should get a head start on looking for some work. So I'm going to get him to look for an odd job. It is Sunday afternoon. All right, Hayden. So what have we got here? Hiking buddy. Well, you could do that because your fitness level is level two. Oh, sand sculpture judge. Charisma level one. Okay, so this hiking buddy pays pretty well. I'm sure Hayden would be able to cope with this, so we are going to choose that. There we go, Hayden. What time does that start? 3 p.m. All right. Maybe have something to eat before you go hiking. Have a quick meal. Have a microwave meal. Maybe a microwave dinner. There you go. Switch off the TV. Go and have a quick dinner before you go hiking. We don't want you to pass out and not get paid. All right. You're going to have to not finish your meal and go and do your odd job. Come on, quickly. So Hayden is off to be a hiking buddy. I hope he <laughs> is a success at his job. So I was thinking he ages up into young adult in five days. He is going to become a villainous valentine and try and cause some chaos in the world, try and break up couples. But he also needs to start thinking about a career for when he finishes school. He is... He is a high school B student. He actually was a C student and managed to increase his grades to a B student. But I don't know what kind of career a player would have that has a high charisma skill. I was thinking of the business career. I suppose that's something he could go into. But we'll see once he ages up. He's still got five days left of high school. Oh, it was a success and he earned 100 simoleons. Okay. I wanted him to go practice some charisma skill in front of the mirror, but I don't know if he'll be able to because he's so angry. He's hot-headed, so I find sims that have the hot-headed trait, it's quite difficult. All right, come on, you go and practice some speech in front of the mirror. Go and inc increase your charisma skill. So Hayden is charisma level 8. He is 54, 55% complete, so not long to go, and he'll be charisma level 9. There you go, have a quick toilet break. And you go and finish your microwave dinner that you didn't finish earlier. And back to practicing charisma with you. There you go. Come on. Go and practice charisma. Oh, he did not like that microwave dinner. It was cold in the middle. Okay. You need to start looking after your body more as well. You are now a player. You need to start with regular exercise and concealing your acne. It didn't seem to bother him though when he has acne. Some of the other teams that I've had, it seems to bother them, but the acne just doesn't seem to bother him at all. Alright, how's the charisma doing? Okay, alright. Let's see if we can get to level 9 and then you can go to bed. Alright, so he's almost charisma level 9. He's now so exhausted, he just cannot carry on practicing speech in the mirror anymore. So he's taken himself off to bed. And practicing charisma was just no fun for him whatsoever. His fun has dropped drastically. And he's hungry again. Alright, will you go and... What about some oatmeal for breakfast? And I think once he gets to school, he can go and work out on the treadmill. Come on, Hayden, go and clean up. I know he has a maid, but I think he should learn to clean up after himself as well. He doesn't like doing it. All right, Hayden, time to go and work out on the treadmill. Oh, thank goodness he came to school in his everyday outfit instead of his underwear. He normally comes to school in his underwear. I'm so glad you decided to come to school in normal clothes. There we go. Go and work out. I think you need to... He's supposed to be studying for exams, but I think he needs to work on his body. He's supposed to have a magnificent body as a player. And he's not, I mean, he hasn't done too badly with the fitness skill. He is fitness level two. All right, Hayden, I think you can stop working out and start to make your way to class or at least make your way upstairs. Attend math class. Okay, go and attend your math class. Oh, look, Hayden is taking notes. Ah, oh, shades of schadenfreude from a bitter sentiment 
towards someone feeling bad. It can be a little gratifying to see someone suffering depending on the someone. Okay, who's suffering? That's interesting. Okay. Oh, he's still upset about his microwave food being cold in the middle. Is that from the oatmeal that he had for breakfast? Oh, I'm sorry, Hayden. We'll have to give you a proper meal when you get home later. No more microwave food for you. Okay, let's go off to the bathroom. Let's go use the bathroom and then we can and then we can get something to eat. I'm gonna see if we can squeeze in a shower as well at school. Alright, you go order some food. What are we gonna have? Junior lunch, there we go. You can have a junior lunch. Alright, he's gotta be friendly with the student. Shall we be friendly with Dwayne? Oh, Dwayne's leaving before we can get a chance to be friendly. I think Dwayne's a bit cross with us because he caught us flirting with someone else, didn't he? I'm sure. Oh, he's resentful about no prom invites. Oh, okay. Yeah, I thought Dwayne was a romantic partner. Is he just a romantic interest? Oh, we couldn't get Dwayne to be our romantic partner. That's right. And Dwayne is resentful about a no prom invites. Oh, here's Kawari. Kawari wasn't interested in us. She doesn't want to be a romantic interest or even a romantic partner. Every time we try with her, she... Look how he's looking at her. <laughs> Is Kawari the one that's making him feel tense? Hmm, could be. Should we try and be friendly with her? Oh, she's also leaving. Alright, let's try and be friendly with Dwayne. Let's have some small talk. Let's get to know Dwayne a little better. Uh, let's just shake hands. Ah, oh, Dwayne is a bro. All right, let's attend science class. I think Hayden has football after school. Yes, he does. So he won't be able to do an odd job today, but he could do one tomorrow. And he only has four days left. All right. We need to max out that charisma skill. Hayden's getting so good at the school thing. He's taking notes again. Oh, Hayden, so proud of you. Try to take a rock. No stealing today. I don't think Hayden's a thief. I, th I think he's gonna say no stealing today. He's an upstanding citizen. He might be. A he might be a player, but he's definitely an upstanding citizen. Okay. All right, Hayden, you go home, and then you go to football. Oh, look at all these ladies hanging outside our house. Sorry, ladies. Hayden is off to football practice in five minutes. Three minutes. Two minutes and off he's going to football. Alright, Hayden has some bills to pay, so let's do that first. Oh my word, he's gonna have no money left. Oh Hayden, I'm so sorry, but he has to pay those bills. Okay, Hayden, I think you need a shower. Let's have a shower and then we can make ourselves a proper meal. We can have some what are we gonna have? Minced pork noodles. There we go. He's actually cooking level four, which is pretty good. It's having to look after himself all these years. His parents passed away and he had to fend for himself. They did leave him an inheritance, so he was able to keep the house. But now his money's starting to run out. He only has 300 simoleons left. But having to look after himself, his cooking is pretty good. I mean, it's level four. I don't know if he likes cooking though. Is it something he enjoys? Oh, oh, he dislikes mischief. That's interesting. He likes fitness. He doesn't like funny sims. Okay, so no joking with you, hey Hayden. All right. I always like to, I never ever give my sims likes and dislikes in Credit Sim. I always like to let them develop as they go along in the world. I think it just makes it a little bit more interesting. Sometimes it surprises me what they like and dislike. <laughs> I'm surprised that Hayden dislikes mischief and he dislikes funny sims. Oh no, come on, quickly put that out. Call fire department, go here. No, extinguish yourself, get away, we don't want you to die. Come on. Oh no. Now the fire alarm goes off. This is the second time this has happened to Hayden that he started a fire in his kitchen. Oh, okay, so he got a little. <laughs> He got some money, but I don't know. He doesn't have enough money to replace anything. Oh, he doesn't have enough money to replace his stove. Oh dear, I'm sorry, Hayden. At least they gave you a little bit of money. But your microwave's still working. All right, microwave dinner it is. 
Chicken nuggets, there we go. Go, quickly, make yourself some chicken nuggets. And I suppose a shower is in order after your chicken nuggets. We haven't had time to practice charisma. So maybe if he goes to bed, no, nah, he can practice charisma in the morning. There we go, off to bed with you. Now this is, needs to be repaired as well. Okay, I suppose we could get a cheaper stove for him. I'm going to leave it for now because he does have the microwave. Alright, you know what? He's actually got a little bit of energy. Let's let's wake up and go and get to Charisma level 9. He hasn't got long to go. Shame, look at him. <laughs> oh, he's all dirty after the fire. I'm sorry, Hayden. Yay! He's reached level 9 of the Charisma skill. Okay. Alright, he seems to be on a bit of a roll here, so I'm going to leave him to practice for a little bit. How's his needs doing? Okay, he's not having any fun. Alright, you can watch a little, all right, little bit more charisma skill, and then you can go and watch some television. How's that, Hayden? Okay, he's had enough. Alright, you can watch some TV. He likes watching TV. He's a bit of a TV addict. He's confident from from silver tongue <laughs> practicing speaking can give us some a great confidence boost can we go and practice some speech again go to the toilet first and then go and practice your speech seen as your confidence i think you need a shower hayden all right hayden i'll let you have a sleep before school oh I cried out why is he sad all alone from people person lifestyle oh i'm sorry hayden and talking to yourself in the mirror just didn't help all right we'll go to sleep Maybe you'll feel better in the morning. You'll see all your friends at school tomorrow, Hayden. Alright, we are going to join Hayden at school. Any guess if he's going to be in his underwear or his everyday clothes? I'm not sure what outfit this is. Okay. Are we doing the unbuttoned shirt look today? Alright. Work out on treadmill. Yes, that is a good idea. Let's go and work out on the treadmill. Oh, he's still sad. Are we gonna study for exams? He's increasing his fitness skill. I'm just gonna let, it, let him carry on with that until it's time for school. All right, let's quit the treadmill and let's go to our class. What is our first class today? Social studies, okay. All right, lunch. He is hungry, so let's go get some lunch. Are we gonna be first in line? What are we gonna have? Senior lunch, there we go. Alright, so we have to be friendly with the student. Shall we try with Gunther? Although I don't think we have a very good relationship with Gunther. He does not like us. Wolfgang. Is it Wolfgang or Gunther? I always want to call him Gunther. Wolfgang, that's it. And I should actually know that because one of my sims had babies with him. So, <laughs> Wolfgang. I must remember. Wolfgang, not Gunther. Alright, let's be friendly with Wolfgang because... We need to be friendly with the students. Alright, let's get to know Wolfgang. Yeah, they don't have a good relationship. They don't like each other. Alright, well let's go try and be friendly with Molly. Ask for advice. There we go. Go ask Molly for advice about all your romantic interests that you have to keep happy. All your romantic partners that you have that you don't know what to do about. You've got all these romantic partners and you don't know how to keep them happy. So let's see if Molly can help us out. Oh, she's crying. She thinks it's just so sad that you have all these romantic partners. Well, he's got eight romantic partners. One for every day of the week and one as a space. So, he's, he's not doing too badly. All right. Be friendly with a faculty member. Actually, you know what? Can we quickly go and practice some charisma in the, in the mirror? There we go. Go practice speech before class. See if you've got time for that. All right. Go and attend language arts class. There we go. So I think after school, Hayden better go and do another odd job. <laughs> oh, he did get money from the insurance the for the fire. So he's actually got a bit of money. But I do ne think he needs to start getting some sort of work ethic. All right, Hayden, let's go home and look for a odd job. Why are there always people hanging around outside our house? Okay, well, let's, let's go and say hi to Morgan. Hug lovingly. There we go. She is a romantic partner after all. Oh, but there's no romance. Okay. Oh, she's, she caught us cheating, didn't she? I'm sure she... Ah, oh, drifting love. I'm sure she she caught him cheating. All right, Hayden, stop messing around with Morgan. You need to get a job. You need to go and 
Earn some money. Find an odd job. Are we going to be a hiking buddy again? Seeing as that is appearing again. let's. We did so well last time. Let's... Let's go and do that again. He can be a professional hiking buddy. When does it start? 4 p.m. Okay. And Hayden is off to his odd job. I hope he doesn't pee himself along the way. Sure, this hike is taking a long time. It's also almost 7 o'clock. Okay, another success. Alright. Okay, Hayden. I'm going to let you have something to eat. Microwave pastry. And then you can go practice some charisma. Oh, he just doesn't like microwave food. Alright, let's practice speech. I do find that Hayden increases his charisma skill much, much faster when he practices in front of the mirror. When he reads a book, it does nothing. He has charisma books, but they just don't work for him. He does much better in front of the mirror, probably because he's admiring that wonderful face and body. Alright, Hayden is exhausted. I'm going to let him watch a tiny bit of TV and then he's going to go to sleep. Just increase his fun a little bit because <laughs> practicing charisma just really decreases his fun. So watch a little bit of TV and then you can go to sleep. So we are back to practicing charisma skill after a good night's sleep and a quick shower. We are going to practice until it is time for school. Alright, let's join Hayden at school. All right, Hayden, quickly go use the toilet. <laughs> Shame, he is in desperate need of the toilet. There we go. And his charisma skill is 67% complete. So once he's done in the bathroom, he can actually just carry on practicing speech before his lesson starts. Okay, so Hayden is attending art class. Does he have any painting skill? Oh, he does too. Okay. <laughs> I think he's just I think he's just got painting skill now in art class. Hayden has football practice after school. Alright, Hayden, go grab yourself some lunch. Just a veggie slider is fine. Alright, Hayden, we get need to get your social up. Oh, there's Sydney. There we go. Let's be romantic with Sydney. Or oh, okay, well let's just let's be friendly with Sydney. Enthuse about meal. These veggie sliders are great. Smooth apology. Why do we have to apologize to Sydney? Alright, well, let's apologize for whatever we did. Did he also catch us cheating? Oh, he's giving him a little peck on the cheek. And it is time for computer science class. So did he just skip class? He just He's just standing around staring at his lunch. He didn't go to computer science class. Oh, Hayden, that's not going to look good. Oh, and here comes the principal. Is she not going to catch you? No, no detention for you. Oh, oh, Hayden, why did you skip class? Ah, huh. I don't think he got detention. I think she let him off the hook. All right, it is time to go to football practice. I still don't know why I didn't go to class. I didn't even notice he wasn't in the class. I thought he was in the class. I was just fast forwarding to the end of the day. Oh, at least he doesn't have detention for skipping class. Alright, he's off to football practice and then he is going to come home. Oh, what is this? Hayden can either show off some cool moves or keep calm. He is going to show off his cool moves. Performance gain. There we go. Alright, Hayden, I think you can actually go to sleep. Come on, go to sleep. Are you too exhausted to drag yourself to bed? Alright, you have a little nap. He has got two more days. Two more days of high school. Oh, you better make the most of it, Hayden. Can we squeeze in a little bit of charisma? No, he's, <laughs> he's too tense. Alright, let's watch some TV. That always releases the tension. You know, for someone that has lots of girlfriends and boyfriends, he is always lonely. Shame. He's filling his life with the wrong people. He needs to find the one, but unfortunately he's a player, so... Maybe when he's a young adult, as a villainous valentine, he might find the one. But alright, let's go practice some speech, see if we can max out the charisma skill. Oh, it's almost Hayden's birthday. Alright, so Hayden needs a quick toilet break. He's almost maxed out the charisma skill. He is on 93%. Alright, Hayden, come on, you can do it, I know you can. Let's max out the charisma skill. 
97%. Come on, just a little bit more. A little bit more, Hayden. A little bit more. Come on, a little bit more. Almost there. Yeah, he's a smooth talker. Oh, Hayden, I'm so proud of you. All right, well, I'm going to say goodbye to Hayden for now. The next time we see him, he is going to be prepping for his birthday for aging up into young adults. We are going to invite all his romantic partners. He's going to have a big party and they are going to age up with him. I'm going to make sure that they age up with him so he can have all his romantic partners be young adults as well. Bye Hayden. See you next time.